Things that remain unsolved. Human combustion. Spontaneous human combustion refers to a living person who catches fire without any logical explanation. While cases are rare, they still occur to this day. This phenomenon is widely unaccepted by the scientific community. However, some have experienced it firsthand. The Crooked Forest. In Poland, there is a grove of 400 or so trees called the Crooked Forest. These trees grow with a curve or bend in them and then go straight up like normal trees do. The curves in all the trees face north. Theories as to why the trees curve include the trees being buried under heavy snow during the beginning of their lifetime, human intervention or shaping of the trees. So this is actually pretty common with trees like bonsai trees. And finally, gravity. However, there is no scientific reason why these trees grow the way they do. The self-driving road. A stretch of highway outside Prosser, Washington is referred to as Gravity Hill. The legend goes that if you put your car in neutral when you get to this road, it will start to roll uphill. With the price of gas nowadays, I wish all roads would do this, but anyway, there is no scientific reason why cars roll uphill. Some say it is the spirit of ghosts pushing the car, while others say it is just an optical illusion. Uh, but right around the start line, it looks pretty flat. We're going to pop it in neutral and see what happens. We're moving. not even showing up in my speedometer. I don't know how fast we're going. A little faster. It's kind of spooky. We're doing about eight. And we appear to be going up this hill. This is weird. All right, that looks like we're still going, still going. All right, that's, uh, this is weird. We're gonna check the back bumper. Okay, I don't see any handprints, which is a relief to me. If I was pushed, there is no evidence. I don't have equipment to test for gravity changing mineral deposits, but I do have equipment to test another theory, that Gravity Hill is just an optical illusion. If you don't want to see what the level says, close your eyes now. Placing the level down on the start line, the bubble is here. This is level. You can open your eyes. I tested the rest of the run up to Gravity Hill, and the reading was the same till nearly the base of the slope. The Man from the Future. From the short documentary film titled Confessions of a Time Traveler, released in 2020, a man, Sebastian, claims to be a time traveler from a thousand years in the future. The man is unidentifiable and had no identification when detained by the police. In the interview, the man claims to be sensitive to technology and says this is common for people from the future. The man would disappear unexpectedly and has never been seen since. So why the mask? I have to wear it. And why is that? My immune system. If you had any idea what you were breathing in right now, you'd be wearing a mask too. Pods are the only kind of living quarters that can protect us from the air pollutants. Would you be willing to allow us to x-ray that, that chip in your hand so we can get a visual of it? We pay for it, of course. You don't believe me, huh? No, I'm not saying that, that, that at all, but visual proof of it would obviously substantiate your claim. Set it up. Yeah? Absolutely.
his x-ray results proved exactly what he said. Although we can't determine the actual technology of the chip itself, Sebastian does, in fact, have a foreign object implanted in his hand. Sheriff's deputies recovered a body. They say it is a male, but they were not able to make a clear ID. While there's no face to put with the story, human remains found in a thickly wooded area off Old Highway 20. There's no face to put with the story, only belonging. A real life mystery that today sits stored away in evidence bags. Around 8 this morning, a body was found. Police right now calling this a suspicious death investigation. Although we can't confirm that this is in fact the remains of Sebastian, I did find it strange that the victim's left hand was missing. That would have been the hand he had the chip in. Skinwalker Ranch. A skinwalker is a Navajo mythical creature said to be a shaman or witch that can transform into an animal. Skinwalker Ranch is a 512 acre ranch located near Ballard, Utah. Skinwalker Ranch has been at the center of a number of unexplained phenomena even to this day. From the existence of skinwalkers, hence the name, to UFO sightings, this ranch has been a host for paranormal occurrences for over 50 years. There's even a show, The Secret of Skinwalker Ranch, about a team of veterans, paranormal investigators, and scientists who dedicate their time to solving the mysteries of Skinwalker Ranch. There is a ranch in northern Utah. It is considered the epicenter of the strangest and most disturbing phenomena on Earth. Look at the surveillance footage and see if there's something in it. There it is. We saw new folk. And the fact we have captured this on camera is nothing short of historic. 